most cherished memories I have since we've been together is the day that you and your grandmother, parents, and sister Pam came back from picking out your wedding dress. When you were away, your grandmother pulled me aside and told me how special you were. And without even having to say it, I knew Im immediately what she meant. I told her that you have a good heart, but what I meant by that really goes beyond any words that I could have to describe it. And yet, that unspoken understanding of the deeply compassionate person that we both could see in you was all that was needed. Because in truth, everybody that truly knows, knows you can see it too. That part of you is what has always drawn me to you and what makes me strive to be a better person when I'm around you. And so it is with a sincere heart that I can truly say that I consider myself to be the luckiest man in the world to have found you. I love you, Tracy. And I promise that I will aspire each day to be the best husband I can to you through the good, good times and the bad, through all of the moments that we will celebrate and cherish together as well through all the struggles. Wherever our lives may take us, I will be there for you with my companionship and support, and I will continue to love you now and forever. There have been many other moments when I knew that you were perfect for me, and I had a good feeling about our relationship ever since I first met you at the Limoncello restaurant in Westchester back on June 15, 2019. And you're one of the most unselfish people that I know. You make me feel happy, safe, and loved, and you're always patient and kind with me, even in times of stress. You accept and you love me for who I am. And here come the tears. And I've always been comfortable in telling you anything. Like all couples, I know that we're gonna go through our ups and downs. This is unavoidable in any relationship. But I vow to love you and to care for you in both sickness and in health, and to always strive to make you happy. I promise to always be your friend and your loyal partner. Ugh. I know I was gonna cry. <laughs> and to always support you and to be your cheerleader. I feel lucky and blessed to have you in my life and I think that we make a great team. And I'm excited to spend the rest of my life with you and to officially marry you today in the presence of friends and family. And I'll just end my vows by saying that I love you. So Bill, what token do you give of the vows you have made today? A ring. If you'll take that ring, please. If you'll place it upon Tracy's finger, hold her hand tight, and repeat after me to her, please. With this ring. With this ring. I thee wed. I thee wed. Very good. Tracy, what token do you give of the vows you have made today? A ring. If you'll take this ring, please. Place it upon Bill's finger, hold his hand tight, and repeat after me to him, please. With this ring. With this ring. I thee wed. I thee wed. It's my distinct privilege and truly an honor to now pronounce you husband and wife. Bill, if you give me one second to step out of the way, <laughs> you may now kiss your beautiful bride.